Good morning again, everyone. Good morning. Welcome to our second presentation. Oh, third presentation. Mr. Heng Kuni is going to make a presentation about tourism industry in Cambodia. Please welcome. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. First of all, I would like to pay my best card to Mr. Poisela, hospitality teacher from Puerto Rico School and classmate. And thank you, teacher, for allowing me to stand here and make a presentation. And would like to apologize if something wrong or impact with you. Before I go deeper on my presentation, I would like to introduce my content. First one, I will be talking about the meaning. And the second, I will be talking about the category of tourism industry. And second, or third, probably talking about tourism destination. The fourth is talking about the tourism area. And last one, talking about the increase of tourism industry in Cambodia. Next, tourism industry. What is tourism? I have three meaning with us. Three different meaning of tourism. The first one is mean that the activity or practice of touring, especially for pleasure. The second is mean the business or industry of providing information, transportation, accommodation, and other services. And the last meaning is talking about uh, is mean that the promotion of tourist travel, especially for commercial purpose. And tourism industry is the largest sector of the Cambodia economy, and it is this, the second largest of income to the economy or uh, Cambodia economy after common industry. And then I will, I will talking about the category of tourism industry. There are five categories. Next. There are five categories of tourism in Cambodia. The first one is, topic, is cultural tourism, natural tourism, entertainment tourism, business tourism, and political tourism. And next, cultural tourism. Cultural tourism is the tourists prefer to the culture, cultural country, and they want to visit the culture, culture and this story, this story sum is referred to in the province and we can visit cultural village also and next, natural tourism natural tourism is mean that the tourists that refer to the natural, natural place and there are two area of natural tourism such as Coastal area and the forest of the hill. Coastal area is refer to the big and it is refer to the Gokong, Senovil and Cap. And the forest of the hill area is refer to the place that have the mountain and many forests. It refer to Mundalkiri and Ratnagiri province. Next. Entertainment tourism. Entertainment tourism is take away from the people's stress basically when they uh, when they come from work and from school they always stress and they always visit to entertainment. Next business tourism. Business tourism is referred to the tourists that come to or uh, come to visit and uh, some destination for business purpose and during the, uh, they come during their work right? political tourism political tourism is the one of the tourism that refer to the political tourists and they always come for the political purpose and this tourism is referred to Phnom Penh capital city. When they come for the political, they always come 
ชูนมแบบอันนี้ and now we're talking about the decrease or increase of tourists from 2006 2016 to 2017 increase and and decrease all way processing and the China is always increased from 2016 to 2017, increased about 31.3%. .31 and Vietnam is always decreased until 11%. And about the Korea, decreased also about 2.8%. And Laos always decreased until 81.5% and Thailand Thailand for increase 4.4% U USA always 5.8% and Japan is Japan is <laughs> increased until 6.9% about France France is increased for 10.6 percent and the last is Germany they come increase for 9.7 percent and next tourism area there are four category of area of tourism area in Cambodia the first one is coastal area the second is eco tourism and on all area the last one is around the capital city area. Coastal areas is referred to the the beach area such as Sayanville, Kokom and Cap. And all of all of tourists when they come to visit the beach, they always go to the Sayanville. We call it Kompong South Beach. It is very nice and can enjoy it. Uh, the swimming and especially for the seafood and make eco tourism eco tourism is refer to the the place that full of the forest and it never it never destroyed from anything or it will we can say stay long as well and eco tourism is say as actually like the Pung Pluk, Rectal, and Kota Thai also. And on Koh area, Koh area is located or it refers to the Siemria province and it is the most temple, the most famous temple of Cambodia and the uh, traveler, traveler should not miss out, uh, should not miss when they arrive Cambodia. And only thirty-seven dollar per person a day. And last around the capital city area, around the capital city area, refer to Phnom Penh, and the place that is located around the capital city, such as Koh Phi and Phnom Penh. Next destination. There are many destination of Cambodia, but now I just mentioned only top five destinations in Cambodia. The first one is Phnom Penh, second is Angkor third is Busra Waterfall, fourth is St. Louis Beach, and both all national park is Kampo Province. Next. Now Phnom Penh. When the traveler goes to Phnom Penh, they always, uh, they should not miss the Royal Palace. Royal Palace is open the public when the king is resident and it's, all, it's just only three dollar per person and it's open from at the morning from 7 30 to 11 or oh, yes and afternoon open from 2 p.m to 5 p.m next on forward on forward is located at siemre province and it is the most famous temple of Cambodia also and on 
it is the uh, when the traveler come uh, no came there by Angkor because Angkor is the our uh, I say the most famous like Busra waterfall. Busra waterfall is located in Mondragori ruins and all travelers can enjoy their shower in there and with the cool air, cool forest air. Right? Say hello to Beach. Say hello to Beach is referred to Kumpung South Beach and the traveler go to San Uyen Beach to visit the Kumpung Song. It is a very nice beach and they can enjoy their swimming for relaxing and for eating seafood. The, the last destination is Boko National Park. Boko National Park is located in Kumpo province and traveler can enjoy the green scenery and cool mountain air and the traveler can use the motorbike up to the hill when they don't want to walk up finally i would like to thank you for paying attention